It's Tuesday of American Girl Doll Cooking Camp Week. Hi, parents. Uh, t tonight, you're going to have a treat of Swedish meatballs. So you need to preheat your oven to 400 degrees and uh, put the meatballs on cookie sheets and bake for 10 minutes or until a little bit browned on the outside. Remove the meatballs. You can use a slotted spoon because that way you'll get any grease off of it. And turn the oven temperature down to 350 degrees. You should have a casserole dish that has the um, mushroom soup mixture in it with sour cream and other ingredients. And you're going to put the meatballs that are partially cooked and drained in with the sauce, spoon the sauce over it, and then cover it with aluminum foil and bake it for 350 degrees at 350 degrees for about an hour. And it'll be delicious if you put it as a topping over noodles, or you can just use toothpicks and pretend you're at a cocktail party and have Swedish meatballs. Um, you're, you also have the angel crisps to bake and they go in the oven at 350 degrees uh, for uh, 10 to 12 minutes until they're just a little golden on the outside. If you're using parchment paper, you want to be sure that you leave it on the parchment paper until it's completely cooled, and then you'll be able to lift the cookies off. Uh, you also have some prep to do for Wednesday, uh, things that the kids maybe can't handle or shouldn't be handling. One is for you to peel the potatoes. So there are four potatoes, four large potatoes that you, you'll need, large like uh, baking potatoes. And you're going to peel them and cut them into, uh, into quarters and then boil them on the stove in water for about 20 minutes. And then you can put them in a, con a plastic container um, with uh, water filling it uh, in the refrigerator until Wednesday. And you're also going to chop up, peel and chop the apples. You need two cups of chopped apples and you're going to do that. Put them into a bowl or a Tupperware container and uh, put them in uh, the refrigerator covered until Wednesday. That'll be for the Waldorf salad. Thank you.